And in Georgia, a similar story where a Georgia man is now in custody after police said he shot a three year old relative during an argument with another family member. In other words, this guy, according to Gwinnett County P Police Corporal Jake Smith, was trying was in an argument with a family member, an adult, presumably. And in threatening that adult with a gun, he ended up shooting a different three year old and that li that little boy has now died. Um, he was the, the boy was laying on the driveway outside the home when police arrived. He was transported to a hospital and subsequently died. Uh, the shooter, uh, Luis Efrain Torres, never left the scene of the shooting. He was taken into custody, charged with murder and aggravated assault around two in the morning. And uh, a police officer explained at this time, we don't think he intended to actually shoot that child. We do believe he was trying to shoot someone else that was there. We often hear Lewis about your own gun being used against you as opposed to you using it for self-defense. This is a case of trying to use your own gun against someone else and actually killing a third party. Uh, and it just goes to show Lewis, I guess. I mean, what's the solution? Should the three year old have uh, exercised his Second Amendment rights by having a gun on him to defend himself in case a gunfight broke out? I mean, what what is the solution here other than just continuing this senseless slaughter of, of little kids? I think I think once again, the solution is probably just the harshest penalties imaginable for gun negligence. Right. And in this case, we do have a charge of murder. I don't know if that will stick because it does appear that there was no intent to kill this three year old. There was no premeditation. There was not even any intent to cause harm. But we'll, we'll follow the case and we'll see what happens. Meanwhile, the gun enthusiasts continue to stockpile ammunition for that day. I guess that's coming soon, I guess, towards the end of Obama's presidency where he's going to take everybody's guns and ammo. But that that still hasn't happened. Yeah. And David, you know what? That's the day when uh, half of these idiots are going to end up shooting themselves uh, accidentally. 